Okay. Okay. What is up guys, it is me, the official here. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to create and customise a server, a Discord server. Um, I have already uh, made a part one on this, so it should be on your screens right now, you can just click on it. And um, basically on that one I just teach you how to make roles and how to customise them. And just really the, the, the really basic ones. Um, on this one I'm going to be showing you how to get bots on your server and like you know, how to get the commands and stuff and how to use bots in general. And then I'm probably going to make a part 3, maybe explain some more stuff, but I might, this probably might be the last video about Discord servers. So um, if you have any suggestions below on whatever tutorials I can make, uh, can you please drop a comment below. And yeah, alright, let's get started. So obviously, um, first off, you would probably need Discord, um, but like the Discord um, app. I've already made the server in that, again, that was from the last tutorial, so I've done all this already. Uh, you know, done done all this. Um, but yeah, um, I'm gonna show you an example of a bot. So on my server here, we have a bot called Dino Bot. Basically, he can play music and that. So I'm gonna go into a lounge right now. Hopefully, no one joins. I'll probably have to cut it out so he does join. So yeah, that's just showing my server, here, my um thing here. Uh, I've got a lounge, and that's say for example, I wanna listen to some music on my bot. So obviously, each bot has um like a slash at the start of the command. Uh exclamation mark uh question mark you know that maybe sometimes eat three slashes maybe p that you know all of them have a unique start to their commands for example dinobot has the uh, question mark for their uh, command start and then yeah that's how they have it they have unique starts so um yeah on dinobot they have this and then if you want to play music for example let's put play i, I need a non copyright uh, song so um NCS, for example, hopefully this is not going to get co me copyrighted. Come on, there we go. So that should then play the music that I told it to. So, hopefully, no, that doesn't. There we go. So, yeah, this is just a live stream by the sounds of it. Let's just stop here. Just, just again on Dinobot, you just put stop. Hopefully that's not copyright. But yeah, um, yeah, it does sometimes take a while. It's certain bots, you know, it's just straight away like on. Sometimes you can get radio bots and that. But this is just some of the commands that Dinobot can do. Also as well, it can like you know exclamation mark kick people. It can you know just do all sorts of things. And also as well, whenever you get a bot, hopefully there should be a, a command telling you straight away, you know, help or something. And hopefully straight away, it'll just tell you all the commands that the bot has. So that's kind of useful. But um, today I'm just gonna show you how to get Dino Bot. That's just gonna be mine for today. It does music, it does commands. I think it's a really good bot, and do recommend it. I'm gonna put it in the. Uh, I'll put the link to it in the description below, so you can just go over to the link and get it. But obviously in this, I'm gonna just teach you how to get it. So, um, first off, you want to go on Google Chrome. Um, you don't need to go on Discord or anything. It's like a separate website. I'm gonna show you first how to get onto the like you know Discord bots like so uh, the Discord's bot website. Sorry about that. Um, so you know where to get Discord bots. You just type in Discord bots in Google. It should load up, and then you come over to this one here, the bot. This second link here. It's carbon. It text. I'll put that in the link below if you can't be asked to type it up click on that and then it should load you up to the bot page so once you're loaded into the website there's a bunch of um you know bots you're greeted to so first one is web shot it, like every bot bot's description tells you what they do so example hypercast here it's basically a uh, you know a radio station thing based that plays you know bots and stuff like just radio basically uh, typical bot, you know, he does a bunch of commands here. Uh, couch, wall bot, you know, you got loads here. And say, for example, I want, uh, let's see, just choose a random one quick. I don't know what one. Uh, say, for example, I want dab bot. Uh, provides high quality music to your server from YouTube, SoundCloud, and Twitch, and radio stations. So this is a thing here. Um, so yeah, so, say if you want this one, for example. Also, it tells you what, like, you know, how many servers the bot is in. So that's in 64,000 servers. 
It's a pretty decent bot, looks decent, apart from the cringe, the cringy, you know, profile picture in there, and I don't dab, I don't like dabbing, but, you know, it's just for example, funny example. So if you want to add it to your server, you just click to add bot server, opens up a little um, prompt here, this should load up. And then once it's loaded up, you it should it come up with this page here. So um, basically, you'll be greeted to this: add a bot to a server. You have to click on here, which is select a server, and you can select. It has a list of all your servers. You won't if if this is your first time getting something like this, then it will tell you to log into your Discord first on this thing, and then it will take you to this. But when you're on this, once you're here, um, you won't get greeted to this straight away. Um, you would have to log into your Discord, because obviously it's your first time, you would have to log into your Discord. But yeah, once you've logged into Discord, you'll be greeted to this. Choose whatever uh, thing you want it on, so I'll put on my test Discord. Also as well, you can set it to what the bot, like, you know, restrictions to the bot. If you don't want the bot to read messages, which I don't understand why you would untick that, you can. Make it so the bot can't send messages. Again, don't understand why you would do that, but you can. But yeah, that's how it does. And then after you're happy with all this, you can press or authorize. And there we go. You get auto. Uh, you get a, sometimes you get a notification from the bot straight away um, on your server. But yeah, it should come up with this going. You know, authorizing that and like, wow, okay, good. So um, yeah, and then that's the bot just joins automatically. You see it here on your online thing. And also sometimes you just get a text straight away saying, you know, hi, I'm Dabbot, thank you for adding me, blah, blah. And straight away, it does sometimes tell you the command prefix. So there you go, that's the command startup. So you would have to do exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, blah, blah. And also as well, it could tell you some play music options. So for this bot, I think it looks like it's just as music. So, um, yeah, um, so let's say for example, there you go, it says play song. You just put exclamation mark, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, play and then a song, I'm going to do non, non copyright music, oh yeah, I must be in the thing first, yeah, if you do music stuff, well, well, you have to be in a voice channel first, you cannot be in a voice channel, you cannot not be in a voice channel, and have it play music, you have to be in a voice channel, otherwise it won't work, for like music bots, so again, let's put play non copyrighted music, there you go, and yeah, it should come up here. So some bots, it doesn't do it straight away. It tells you what one you can do. Let's say uh, we'll have one. Choose one. There you go. And hopefully it should play. But you know, this is just an example. I'm not going to have it, you know, straight away. This spot, I don't know. I don't like this spot. So I'm going to, you know, stop it. There you go. So um, what I was actually originally going to do is I was going to show you the Dino bot. So that's actually showed a Dino bot now. I think I'll recommend. I highly recommend this. Uh, so I just put whoops Dino bot bot Discord. Uh, you go in there. Dino bot takes you to this one first, and then you can put login with Discord. Probably gonna blur this out if it shows my details. Oh no, it doesn't. There you go. Fort Rise. And there you go, you can select the server, so when you run here, you can select the server you want it to be in, let's say, I want it in my, not, thingy, uh, testing the discords, there you go, it takes you straight to here, it's on the test the discords, and you can the fort rise, and it's in. Again, it takes you to the same page, again, you get a notification popping up straight away, so you know it's joined in, so let's go back on our discord here, and it shows you straight away, in your DMs, all of the uh, commands, so let's say for my previous one, you got all of the commands here. And also as well, it tells you the prefix, you have to have an exclamation mark, no, not exclamation mark, question mark first on your things. So here you go, you've got all your stuff here. So what I like about this bot is it has loads of commands, sorry, wrong server, has loads of commands, and also you can listen to music. This is why I just love this. You can give warnings to people, you can give roles to people, role user. Also as well, you can purge stuff. So, so say for example, you've got a bunch of messages. Let's just give an example here. You've got all these messages this guy just spammed in your chat and you want to get rid of them. You can't be asked to keep going up here and going, eh, delete, you know, 24-7. So instead, you can you just want to get, get rid of them all straight away. You could just put exclamation mark, purge 100. There you go. It should then purge all your messages, delete them all, and bam, you're done. So, um, yeah, that's what it does. I love that option. Also, as well, obviously, again, I've showed you before, it plays music. So, let's just say that, for example. You can play music, and then when it plays, you can put press stop. 
and then you can also show your queue so you can make a queue so you can keep going play so and so and then play so and so and then play and let's see and then you put queue and it shows you the queue of your songs so obviously I haven't got actual queue I'll do it again nope doesn't work for some reason but yeah you can show the queue it shows you all the stuff and that also you can do kick uh, you know you have to put kick and then the member and you can put also the reason do you know, I just love this bot it's actually really good I, I do generally think it's a good bot but that's how you add bots uh, to the server also as well if, if you've got like a bunch of bots and she's online you can also just make a roll for it easily so let's say uh, rolls let's go in here let's call it a bot roll bots let's give it a yellow save changes yeah display that one on dimension you can give it admin if you want because it is a bot after all so i'm going to kick it from that like, server and there you go and then you can just give the bot to people give it to the bots there you go bot on bot there you go it organizes it like very nicely that is a good way uh for example my one here i've got like all mine sectioned out like the bots and stuff also as well while we're here i'll just show you how to get some of these cool icons here if you want if you want any of them the lenny faces all you, all you have to do f to get them is you have to go onto your thing let's just go into google quick and then you can easily go into uh emoji uh no pc emoji emoji lookup converter you can get a bunch of stuff in here you know emojis and stuff or you can get copy and paste copy and paste emojis and you can put all these in so let's say for example uh let's go for um this one you just put i think it's i haven't used this website i don't know what it is but you can go in there and then say for example you want to customize this host test and paste it save done works like that and there you go um also saw like lenny faces for example you can get them easily let's go uh s copy and paste symbols i have forgot what website oh, there you go found it so if you put in copy and paste symbols it's the third link down this is the one that i use i've got all these here you've got loads here um and it's not i'm pretty sure it's not the one the lenny face but if you're looking for something like this, you can. You could easily put into Google as well if you want the Lenny face. Uh, let's just put it in general one. There you go. Paste. Save. There you go. You've got a nice little cool one there. And then also as well, if you want a Lenny, I can show a Lenny here. So Lenny face. Copy and paste. There you go. This is another website I went to. You've got a bunch of Lenny faces here, if you just want the normal Lenny face, it just copies it straight away just by clicking on it. Let's say here, paste, and there you go, you got your Lenny face. You can also put that as a nickname. Sorry if I'm saying, you know, saying stuff really quick. But you know, there you go, you got Lenny face. So that's basically it for this tutorial, showed you how to get bots. Maybe next tutorial, next tutorial I do, I could probably do it so you can actually make your very own bot. So you can make your bot do whatever, you know music bots and that but i might show you how, how to just make a music bot something like that which is pretty cool to do but yeah it'll be a cool tutorial if you guys want that please hit a like and also comment below what what tutorials you want me to do next because i'm really running out of ideas on what tutorials to do because obviously as well i hadn't done tutorials in a long while so yeah um again i'll put the link to my server in the description below if you want to join my server i can do that and also maybe some of my friend servers as well. So thank you guys for watching. If you did please hit a like on this video. And comment below what tutorials I can do next. Uh, I will be putting on screen now the, the last tutorial that I did. So you can go and watch that if you need to. And hope you guys enjoyed it. And see you in the next one. Bye.